Hi, my name is Erin. I'm from Springfield, Vermont. I currently am a sophomore at Bryn Mawr College near Philadelphia where I'm studying French and German. I chose Bryn Mawr because it is a top women's liberal arts college directly outside of a major city, unlike any of the schools at, in Vermont. Racial diversity and perspective were also uh, important considerations in choosing a college. I wanted the full liberal arts experience, and with that, that not only meant uh, being offered a variety of academic subjects, but also learning with and learning from lots of different people. Mar is a part of a consortium of Haverford and Swarthmore Colleges, as well as UPenn, uh, so the academic choices are vast, but not only this, there is a higher percentage of uh, people of other color than in Vermont schools, as well as a higher percentage of international students. I can't afford college without financial aid, and the Vermont State Grant offered me a substantial amount of money that helped me pay directly, well, still continues to help pay directly for my Bryn Mawr tuition. I think the portability of this grant is crucial. First of all, it doesn't discourage students from going out into the world and gaining perspective and knowledge. Um, my dad is from the U.S. and my mom's from France, so I know firsthand that how important and beneficial it is to learn about other cultures and how other societies have new occurring problems and what they are doing to try to figure out or find solutions to those problems. Another great thing about portability is that it allows me to be an ambassador for Vermont. Oddly enough, studying out of state has made me feel even more connected to Vermont. Uh, the Ver Bryn Mawr, Vermont, and New Hampshire Alumna Association reached out to me to ask about my experiences at Bryn Mawr, and they wanted to include it in their local newspaper. Uh, as well as that, I spoke last year at my high school about my experiences out of state, uh, just studying at university in general. Uh, also, every time that I come home for break, I... Uh, participate in the local pep band uh, whenever we go to basketball games or whatever. Um, and then lastly, uh, in one of my city's classes, I had to reflect back on my hometown, Springfield, and um, talk about any problems that are occurring or have occurred in the past and then try, and to, and try to find solutions to um, those problems now. From my perspective, helping students study at the college of their choice is the best way VSAC can help our state prepare for its future.